what's going on everybody um, so I've run into a bit of a problem with my channel um, sorry about that run into a bit of a problem with my channel it appears um, I got a message from uh, a friend of mine Hunter P Brown sometimes in the comments section almost always in the comments section he's a pretty cool dude and he uh, sent me a message on Facebook saying that uh, he was able to open my most recent video but he couldn't watch it I got smacked with a copyright claim um, for of all things an anal cunt song Anybody who knows the band Anal Cunt would know that I don't think really think Seth Putnam, where he's still alive today, would give a fuck if somebody put one of his songs in a YouTube video. In fact, he'd probably just call you gay. Because <laughs> that, that was Seth Putnam. Everything was gay. Um, turns out, uh, after I jumped on my laptop here, I, I was kind of wondering why some of my videos seem to have vanished. Um, what I didn't know is they were still technically visible, but not in like 248 countries. Um, so I fired up the laptop and I went to go, uh, see what was going on with the video that I uploaded this morning, which was the, uh, part one of Indianapolis to Dallas. And I'm hoping that by the time I'm done filming this video and it's up, y'all are able to see it. Uh, it turns out like three or four of my videos where I had put in an anal cunt song, Earache Records uh, struck me with a copyright claim. And while I get it, it's fair. I mean, come on. I'm not trying to monetize my videos. Um, I don't think I'll ever monetize my videos. If there's ads playing on my videos, I'm not getting paid for it. Uh, just so you all know. Uh, A, I don't have enough subscribers. B, I don't have enough watch hours. And C... I'm not doing YouTube for money. Uh, if I were doing YouTube for money, I would have been trying to grow my channel. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm trying to grow my channel, but I would have been like on it, like the other YouTube truck drivers you guys probably watch. Uh, so what I had to do, because I no longer have these videos on my phone, uh, the past videos from months ago that got taken down and the one that I uploaded today, I after I rendered it and everything, I cleared the memory card so I could put it back in my GoPro and film more tomorrow. Uh, so I don't have those video clips. I was able to watch the video on the phone myself and I was screen recording it while I was simultaneously uh, dealing with this. And so what I just decided to do, and I'm sorry uh, that I had to do this, if you go... There's the video where I did the four-stop run back when I had the black truck and the video where I went from prior Oklahoma to Kent, Washington when I also had the black truck. Um, those got smacked with a copyright claim. I didn't know it until tonight. So what I had to do with those videos and with my newest video is I had to mute um, any of that audio because I wasn't gonna sit here and screen record all that and then go into the video editing software that I do this all on my phone and try to cut clips and silence audio and add new audio. Uh, I'm not doing that. Um, it's just way too much of a hassle. Anybody who knows Anal Cunt knows their songs aren't very long anyways, so you guys might have to deal with, at the most, two minutes of silence while a time-lapse drive video or something is going on. I didn't want to have to do this. It hurts the quality of my videos. And unfortunately, I'm probably going to have to do it with the next video, uh, the part two of Indianapolis to Dallas, because there are there's just a, a slew of anal cunt songs all in a row together. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do about that. I can't. I can't edit that video, so I might, I might have to screen record it and uh, do what I didn't want to do just for that. 
because I don't have any of this music on my computer. Um, it's all on my phone. I'm doing all the video editing on my phone. And so I'm, I'm going to have to, I don't know if that's going to hurt the video quality or the sound quality or what. And this really kind of pisses me off because, I mean, come on, Earache Records. Really? Anal cunt? You're copyright claiming anal cunt. The most retarded band that ever existed. The most offensive band that ever, one, well, one of the most offensive bands that ever existed, who was fronted by an absolute madman who didn't even want the band to go as far as it did. In interviews, Seth Putnam said, this was only supposed to be one album. It was a fucking joke that has gone on for too long. Come on. Come on, Digby, over at uh, Earache Records. What the fuck, man? Let us little YouTubers use Seth's uh, psychotic, retarded, gay music in our fucking videos. It's, it's fucking anal cunt. It's not like I'm going out there and... and uh, using one of your bigger bands... I mean, yeah, okay, Anal Cunt's kind of big, but because of the meme. Anal Cunt is just... Anal Cunt was a meme before memes ever existed. Let's just put that one to bed right now. The other songs that I use on my videos, they're either so obscure that they're not getting claimed, or the record companies just didn't care. Um... Like in the past, my past videos where I used a lot of uh, Blood Red Throne or Emperor or Burzum, they're not getting copyright claimed. Um, my intro, Mean Man by Wasp, I can't monetize my videos because I have a Wasp song as my intro. That's fine. I don't want to monetize it. But Earache Records is putting a copyright claim that completely blocks my video from being viewed. That is bullshit. I highly doubt anybody is going out there and, and ripping off fucking anal cunt. I mean... They're kind of a niche band. Yeah, all the metalheads know who anal cunt was, but there's only a select few of us that... <laughs> actually enjoy it. Uh, I mean, yes, it's mostly just noise and Seth putting them screaming like an idiot or going, woohoo, or saying things are gay. But I find them funny. I like the music. I want to use it in my videos. I'm not trying to fucking steal anybody's money. I'm not trying to monetize my videos. So with that, I'd like to say, fuck you, Eric Records. You're a bunch of dicks. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, I'm sorry in the next two videos that uh, there's probably going to be some silence instead of music. I don't know if you're just, you know, putting it on for the playlist while, uh, while you're driving and listening to some tunes or if you're actually investing your time watching these videos. I know not many people watch my videos, but, you know, some do. I have a very, very small dedicated following that I really appreciate. And I just, I guess in the future, I just won't use any more fucking anal cunt songs. I'm really just sticking them in there to piss off the people that keep complaining about the music that I put in my songs. I'm not trying to get rich off a of fucking anal cunt. So, like I said, fuck your egg records. Enjoy my videos. They're not going to be monetized. I've got too much of a foul mouth to get monetized anyways. So, fuck that shit. Like, share, subscribe. Fuck you, Earache Records. Anal cunt fucking rules. And Seth would hate this shit.